hard to tell. It's just kind of dingy, but the color the color of the road kind of hides a lot of it. I guess there's some lots of big stains. Two laid stains there. Gonna be hard to tell. I don't I mean there are some stains that are still there and maybe I'm just a little bit Debbie down there but uh, they did do a pretty good job because there were a couple stains uh, right here you can see there's still a stain but that was like a pretty definite black spot and it may have just spread it around I don't know it kind of it pretty well got up the Kool-Aid stains here uh, I think once it dries it's gonna be clean there's some high traffic areas right in front of the couch that are still stained, but it's not. You can see, I don't know if this whole tank was supposed to fill this up, but I'm only about half full. And even the, even the floor underneath, though, it doesn't feel wet. And even the bottom of the carpet doesn't feel wet. And surprisingly, the carpet itself just feels a little bit damp. It's pretty well dry. So you might could run, I haven't read, but this, this may hold several tanks. I don't, I'm not sure. I haven't read that. But we do have the front, uh, the uh, attachment tools. We're going to go out and try to work on the car and let you guys see how that turns out and put a fan on this, let it dry. Oh y'all, also here's, here's the, some dog hair that, didn't make it inside the tank just uh so it's i guess it is obviously it's working because it's sucking up dog hair and i bet there's a ton inside that tank so to get this tank out you just push this button here and pull it it pops right out and we're going to set it over here in the sink fill it up with warm or hot tap water there's a fill line on it And then you add your uh, cleaning solution. I'm using Super Clean here. So you just add it, add a cup there to your lid. Put it inside. I'm I'm gonna repeat. Do not turn this upside down and shake it because water will squirt out this hole. It covered my shirt, so don't do that. So I got a vacuum. I'm gonna vacuum all the seats, get any of the dirt and crumbs out. You can see some of the just sweat stains and drinks and what have you. Chocolate. This is what the kids are the kids ride back here, so they've got everything stained up. So we're gonna try to see if this will remove some of this. We'll, we'll probably do like a pre a pre uh, scrub and before we go back that way to kind of loosen some of this hopefully so this is our little apparatus here it comes with these hoses and so this guy plugs in right here and this guy plugs in right here Now, we're going to prep our seats. Now that we got that hooked up, we're going to try to do a little prep work on our seats, get them scrubbed down with some cleaner, and then hopefully they'll be loose enough. We'll try it on this one and come back and see how it works before we try to prep all of them. We're going to wet the whole seat and scrub it good. Try to get these stains out.
so so far it's doing good but for some reason when you spray water it's like it's spraying dirt out of it you'll get some black dirty particles so i'm not sure i'm gonna i think i'm gonna go ahead and empty this fill tank i don't know this you know this thing gets used by anybody and everybody and they probably never take good care of it can see the large amount of hair and how nasty and dirty that water is. Uh, let's take, we'll take it over there to the, uh, it's got a large, it's got a bunch of dirt and crap in the bottom. I don't know if that was from mine. I guess I probably should have inspected it before I started it up so I could have, so I would have known, but there's a ton of dirt in the bottom. guys I want you to see this is what comes out I don't know what it is it almost looks like just like dirt and lint but when you squirt the, the thing it's it's almost quit now but it's like you're constantly vacuuming and this stuff see it see how it stains so it's like a it's like a grease or something and it just stained the seat so I'm constantly trying to vacuum up now don't get me wrong it's doing a good job but I mean dead gum come on now clean your stuff it's like they don't service them or something. I'll see if it does, that does it again. See that? So there it is again. And you guys, uh, show, I showed y'all the video of the seats before. Uh, now there is, don't get me wrong, there's some, I mean, there's still some staining. You can, you might can see that spot there. There's just some dark staining from like, you know, sit, been sitting for ever since it was new. But like big chocolate stains and sweat stains are gone. I'm going to take it while I've got it. And I'm gonna vacuum out the floor and I'm gonna go over the carpet too, just because I have it for 24 hours. So, and now they see the seats are still wet here. So, you know, I know that being wet is gonna disguise a lot of stain, but I don't think it's gonna disguise the staining that was here before. Got a little stain right there. A little, bit, a little bit right there, but that's not no big deal. Overall, I think it's done a heck of a job on cleaning this this upholstery. Also, was able to get out a lot of the stains and the seal, the head, the head headliner. So I got a lot of most of those out. So we're going to vacuum up and shampoo the carpet.
my battery is going dead so i'm gonna show you this real quick and so the seats are pretty well dry and then i'm telling you there's some stains just some dark deep stains but these things look awesome let the light adjust And so they've been setting. I mean, I've been I've washed outside of the car, and so it's been a minute, and they're pretty well dry. So there were some spots like, like right here that's hard to get to with that big honking doctor rug rug doctor thing. But and man, even the carpets that I shampooed the floors. The sun is killing me. I'm in a bad spot. But even the the carpets and stuff that I shampooed look look really good there was some there were some pretty big stains in this seat so I got most of those out and so overall I'm I'm really pleased with it but it was it was I think $47 for the this is the upholstery uh, kit and then uh, it we worked really well and was able to shampoo our carpet uh, in, in the dining room. So thanks for watching, guys. Hope this helps you make a decision.